So you guys, how, you, oh, how do you think you've done the last couple of games as your playing time's kind of spiked a little bit? Um, I think I've adjusted to the playing time well. Um, it's definitely a learning experience, you know, just uh, playing, playing more, getting acclimated to endurance stuff like that, playing full games. But I think I've, I think I've acclimated pretty well. Were you hurt for a little bit? Like you came back with that elbow brace on for a while. Yeah, uh, in the Colorado game, I uh, sprained my MCL. It was just it was it wasn't uh, a big deal. But I mean, uh, we had the bye week right after that, so it's perfect timing. And uh, the brace is pretty much precautionary. So. What play in the Colorado game did you sprain? Because I think you were in on the play flicker play, right? Yeah, I wasn't on that play. Uh, it wasn't that play. It was it was a series after that. I was running a route and uh, was falling to the ground and stuck my arm out. And it, was, it was all bad. So I'm good now, though. When you, when, uh, when you see ahead. a guy like Caleb go down and then you see a guy like Austin go down, how do you the rest of the tight ends kind of respond and fill in their fill in their role? Um, we all we all know that we have to step up because Caleb was was a big part of our room and. He kind of set an example of how we're all supposed to play. So now that he's out, we we just got to all step up in all areas of our game. So that's what we've been trying to do. How much do you feel like you've grown and matured because you have the playing experience now of full games? Do you feel like you've grown more in the last couple of weeks than you have, you know, the first whatever a year and a half, two years you've been here? Um, I feel like I have I've grown more in just terms of the way uh, the speed the speed of the game. And I also feel a lot more confident just because I've got more snaps and know how the, how the game goes. So. Have you kind of been talking to AVD about you know the transition because he's moving over from wide receiver to tight end? Have you mm -hmm. kind of mentored him a little bit? Yeah, we've been we've been talking to him just about um, mainly just footwork with blocking because he's, he was already a great block blocker at the wide receiver position. He's got good leverage, good hands, and um, yeah, it's just a footwork thing with him. And he, he's going to get a lot better as the season goes on. What's it like welcoming a new guy into your room halfway through the year? Um, it's definitely exciting, just because it's a new face in the room, and um, it just it just ups the competition because we're all trying to play. But um, it's a good it's more the it's more a good thing. When Coach Fish goes back to the game film with the tight ends and Coach Riff, uh, what do they talk about with you that you can get better on, better at, and what have you been doing well? Um, probably the main thing is just finishing blocks because. I'm pretty good on assignment and uh, technique with just finishing blocks and also um, just running routes based on the right coverages so I can get, get open the most.